by now you guys know the grammy is over and uh, of course we are all relaxing down trying to forget the trauma trying to forget the hunger from grammys now you guys know uh, i was able to sleep uh yesterday night grammy night till yesterday night i wasn't able to sleep not because of the grammy itself because i was in shock i was very 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 much in shock how is it possible they nominated that many nigerians and see the kind of songs we are losing grammys losing nomination for so many nobody nobody here before does it really i don't really understand it well <laughs> i don't want to undermine the efforts other people are putting their craft but come on man there are some categories uh, there are some people who do not even belong in any category but the Grammy just want to just twist things around. Yeah? It's quite unfortunate, but I'm still traumatized. We are not still over from that uh, shock because we see a lot of other nationals mocking us. We are not over from the shock yet. We see every, uh, like Ghanaians and every, uh, like South Africa also mocking us, which I'm going to discuss that on, not on this video. I'm going to specially discuss that next time. But it's crazy though, it's crazy. That Grammy, uh, it no go better for you now. Like I've said before, I will say it again. It no go better for all those people that nominate by a set of people. And again, we just feel like Grammy used us. Just the way we feel like Grammy used people like, uh, like Davido, used people like Bonaboy, Use us as a whole because a lot of our entertainers we are the Grammys. A lot of our entertainers we are the Grammys. All because of, uh, majorly because of, uh, I think, because of David Do. You know why I said that? Last year, Grammy, we had the Bonner Boy, but it wasn't that as big as it was. We had whiskey, but it wasn't that as big as it was today. In fact, the Grammy even had so much success. According to chat data, they said this year's Grammy hand reported 16.9 million viewers, up 34% from the last year. 16.9 million viewers. Plus, and majority of those uh, plus they, they got definitely from Africa. And of course, Nigeria first. I have never taken time to watch Grammy as much as I did the last time. Honestly, I've never taken so much time to watch Grammy. Of course, you guys saw me now. I was on live. I was watching it. You guys saw everything. I was there live. I was shocked. I did a lot of videos about the Grammy and everything. 16.9 million. And someone said, David Doe influence. We are coming back stronger next year. People might uh, disagree. Not all that 16.9 million viewers. So we have Taylor Swift and all those big big stars there as well. Though. And again, to to add to this fact that Bonaboy performed at the Grammy, you know, that one again also made a lot of Nigeria really pop up. Africa really, really pop up, up. So I think... Eh, Mm -hmm. Grammy used us. Generally, they used us. They just felt like we need to make something really awkward. Because before I ever organizing that show and everything, the imaginary people, the imaginary people who are in control of Grammy, they don't know them. Eh? Imaginary people who are in control of Grammy. They just be like, you know what? I'm going to give this award to this person. They are giving this award to the person. They are giving this award to the person. They are giving this award to this person. Someone just saw Thailand be like, oh, I like this girl's shape. I like her body and everything. I like her. Let us give her a Grammy. Let's be honest. That's how I saw it. That is what I think. Because you cannot be, I still repeat, you cannot be given an Africa category. Africa, 
you call the award Africa. You gave it to a twerking video. Someone said, what about David O's song? David O's African artists are always singing about, Nigeria artists are always singing about girls, women. Then I said, what about Tyler Water? Tyler Water signifies, if you listen to the lyrics, it signifies what it means is that a man should make a woman come. A man should make a woman sweat. A man should make a woman wet. That's what it signifies now. That's what it signifies. It's a sexual song. It's an Arabian song. You can even do it pop. You put it in that category. Why are you adding it to Africa category? When we have our own local dialect here. If it was Angelica Kijo, what nominated? Hey, give it to him. And hey, give it to us. No problem. Good and fine. For the first time, we have our own Africa award, and you ended up giving it to a white song. Is this not kind of like a colonizing attitude towards Africa? Well, they did what they have to do, though, and they just expect every other artist who want an award in the future should just obey them and let it go. Just take a raw body, do not talk again. Don't say anything. That is how it is. That is how they want it. I do not have any right to complain. Hmm? The day will come and this Grammy will throw it out. The Grammy will throw it out. And I don't know, even if we throw out Grammy, uh, our, our entertainers do not respect our own, uh, our own awards. In fact, the headings are really biased towards Bonner Boy. Let us make that clear. The headings are biased towards Border Boy. The headings the next big award in Nigeria. Hmm? Next big award coming from Africa. Well, I just hope uh, we get it right next time. And do let it be that we're going to have an award like the headings go go up uh, goes as big as a uh, headings award. I like the Grammy Award, which I know is almost impossible, but who knows? Which I know is also is almost impossible, but who knows? Who knows? With uh, con with constant uh, working and constant recognition and everything, I think it will be fine now. Yeah. So the Grammy just decide to use Africa for views, but yet again. They say we should be grateful, okay? Grateful because if you will check, if they want to bring any artist CV, they always put Grammy first. You know, they say so, so artist, multi award winner, and a two time Grammy nomination. That's how they usually put the CV of an artist. And a two time Grammy nomination, or a one time nominated Grammy, or a one time winner, a Grammy award winner. Or four times, you know, in their CV, they always put award and Grammy. Awards and Grammy. So, Grammy is the highest award for any musician. It's very, very important. Eh? No matter how we even talk, if we talk from now to tomorrow, advising our entertainers not to even look at Grammy, Nalao, they will only they will die for the Grammy. They will do himself, eh? Next year, Grammy, we even pray times 10. And now, that the video will pray past me when Grammy done that previous year. You watch and see. Now, now the video will pray pass to win Grammy than that previous year. Just watch and see. Some of you will be like, oh, they don't, we, we don't need Grammy. We need Grammy. All those artists, they need Grammy. They need Grammy die. They feel scattered grand for Grammy. The fee scatter grammy for Grammy, they need Grammy. So don't allow anybody to tell you, although Grammy used us, but that doesn't mean our artists don't want Grammy. They want Grammy. They are going to pray dearly for it. David do might go, go to one week fasting. And now you may want to see us fast. Fast, really, really hard for Grammy. You know Congrats to Thailand though. But come on. The first Grammy ever for Africa category should have come to Nigeria. Because of what we have done musically. From nowhere we became really, really known. Okay guys, bye.